my sister jokes with me. She says, you're not coming back, are you? Because I keep saying, Taiwan's so great. <laughs> I am Pei Lin Yu. I am an associate professor at Boise State University in Idaho, USA. My host institution is National Taiwan University Anthropology Department, and I am a 2016-2017 Fulbright Senior Researcher. My project studies traditional agricultural knowledge among Amis and Paiwan people of Taiwan to better understand resiliency of crops and to develop hypotheses about the first agriculture in Taiwan and also Austronesian seafaring peoples. I'm interested too in climate change and resiliency of indigenous crops. Preliminary results are very interesting. I am interviewing elders in the tribes and they have told me that millet and hongli, which is a sort of a quinoa, are, require a lot of labor to produce. Whereas sweet potato and taro, or yuto, require less labor to produce, and even little children can do those kinds of farming. And rice is somewhere in between. So this gives me an idea for possible adoption of agriculture by ancient people in Taiwan. In Taiwan, I see growing interest among Han peoples, toward indigenous peoples, there's a lot of discussion now about the changing roles of indigenous Taiwanese in Taiwanese society. And I think traditional agriculture touches everyone. It feeds families, it feeds communities, and indigenous agriculture, I think, would be of interest to everyday Taiwanese people. And also, we hear stories about climate change in Taiwan. So perhaps this kind of diverse knowledge can help strategically plan for diverse types of agriculture in a changing climate.